Suppose you are given a message that has been encrypted using a ship cipher. How would you go about deciphering without knowing the shift? So we don't know if the letters have been shifted by 3, by 10, by 12. We have no idea. But what we do know is some basics about the English language. First of all, every word contains a vowel, or it could contain Y. And any word that's only one letter has to be words like maybe I or A. So looking at this message, I noticed that two of the words are one single letter. So these Ys are either I's or A's. I don't know which one, so let me say it's an A. So let's say that the Y came from A. So then everything would be shifted, so Z. So then A, B, C, D, and then just all the way through. L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, V, W, X. I don't know if this is right. So let's go through and see if it makes sense. So the Y was an A. The Q was an S. The C was an E. So I don't think this is right because SE is not an English word. So I don't think this is our cipher. Here the other word that's only one letter is I. So let's say that I was a Y. Or Y was an I. So then it's getting shifted. So A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, F, T, E, Let's see if this one makes sense. So the Y was an I. The Q was an A. The C was an M. Okay, M is a word, so I think this is on the right track. The M was a W. X was an H. Q was an A. J was a T. That's also a word, so I think we got it. K the Y, we know is an A. And then QC, we already did that one, is M. Okay, so just using some basic knowledge about the English language, I was able to figure out that this was shifted by figuring out that one-letter words were either I or A.